Hi there, so today I have something a little bit different for you, maybe that I'll try doing um, for movies that I don't necessarily buy or don't necessarily see for sale. Um, I'm just going to do a review straight from watching it on Netflix. So the movie I have for you this week is called Screwball, the Ted Winfield story. Now, when I saw this, I was just kind of like, wow, what, what the heck is this? So I decided to go ahead and check it out. Um, it's a sports comedy, and it's rated R, and it has a 90-minute runtime. Um, it's directed by Tommy Reed, and it stars Ross Patterson, Joey Kern, Christine Lakin, Alana Ubach, I'm not sure how you say that name, Richard Grant, Edie P Peterson, Nick Thune, these people have weird names, Annie Milder, John DiMaggio, Richard Rele, <laughs> ah, that's probably good enough. Anyways, uh, so the story um, is kind of like a mock documentary, and it, it mainly is um, looking back, obviously, and it, it's talking mainly about the 94 MLB draft, or <laughs> MLB draft, the, stri the MLB strike, and how Wiffle Ball became so popular, there would be 20 to 30 people in the audience watching. And um, basically, it's not uh, Ted Winfield that does most of the talking. It's mostly uh, Willie. Wait, is it Willie? I think it's... Yeah. Yeah, Willie. Um, because in the Wiffle Ball, there's only two players on each team. So Willie is the other player, and Ted Winfield is kind of the, the famous guy. And um, so I think it was in 94... I can't remember if it was 94 or 95. Uh, he goes for the <laughs> the all-time home run record, which was, I believe, either 121 or 122 home runs. So he has to hit 122 or 123. And um, he kind of like uh, parodies some of the, you know, the, the stories in baseball in the last 10 years. Steroids used, uh, corked bats, you know, just stuff like that. And... You know, it's it's kind of dumb, and it it is boring at times. But there is there is some funny stuff. It is kind of funny, like um, just just the stuff he's doing. Like uh, Willie is lives in a trailer park, and he's like really really white trash, and like and uh, Ted thinks he's like the greatest sports star of all time, and you know he's overconfident and cocky and. You know, it's just pretty funny. They they interview other people like writers and um, one thing I thought was funny is it says Dundee production and I was like Dundee like Crocodile Dundee or Dundee like from The Office and actually uh, I don't know what the heck his name is but uh, Robert R Schaefer uh, who plays uh, Bob Vance of Vance Refrigeration on The Office he was actually in it and you know I thought I thought he was kind of funny but. Um, you know, like I said, this isn't the funniest movie or the best movie, and this movie definitely isn't for everyone, but, you know, if you're desperate for for a laugh, uh, you know, maybe you could watch this. I would say, if I was going to score this, that overall, I would probably give it a 2, and it, it only gets that because it did manage to make me laugh quite a few times, and, you know, sometimes comedies aren't that funny, and this one did have enough funny spots to get me through the whole movie, but, uh... If you, if you check this out, let me know what you think, and thanks for watching.